Just tons. These straws, uh, long ago our ancestors used them uh, for drinking the local brews called Amalua in Luganda. And these straws, we used to, they used to get them from uh, their gardens and other places. So we saw it that it could be a great opportunity for us to fight single-use plastic straws uh, with the plant-based ones. We collect two types of the sedge grass and one is thick and wider. This is why we call it the reusable straw because you can be able to clean it as long many times as possible. And then one is thinner uh, which cannot allow you to be reusing it daily. So the moment you wash it badly, you can break it. We use three steps of sanitizing our astros. So we, we wash them and then boil into hot water. We bring them for sun drying. And then after sun drying, we take them into our microwave and then we pack. So they are ready to use. We are looking at uh, making people aware that we are not only not only we can purchase products, but we can also grow products as we grow food. We've been seeing a lot of plastic waste pile up actually in our restaurant uh, among others and uh, really in plastics with containers, with straws and this is one of the forefront items which we see uh, in a glass in front of a client every day and really it's, we thought this is a really great place to start. It's been received very well. Um, surprisingly or unsurprisingly, the customers have enjoyed that each piece has its own style and they understand that they're making their own effort as well to participate in this effort that uh, a growing number of people are, are trying to make. This is the first time I'm seeing it. Before I've used the paper straws and the plastic that are very common everywhere. But I would absolutely use them at home because I feel like you can clean them better and, and I mean it's natural.